we have po boy which is banh mi with me banh mi uh, vermicelli and spring roll with specialty with the lily spring roll with strawberry and avocados and rice dish I was born and raised in Saigon and uh, we, we are boat people so we came from uh, Vietnam on a boat yes so my father was a chef um, he cooked for like very high end people like yes. New Orleans is so very similar to Vietnam and the thing the food and the people are so friendly you have to love it you can't just have a restaurant because you want to make some money. You have to have your heart in your food. Dedication. Lots of dedication. Otherwise, you will fall. You fail right away. Many Americans, the outcome is, but if you do it with your heart, and you do it authentically, then I don't think you will fall. Authentic means, just like in Vietnam, you don't... For instance, unauthentic is a peanut sauce. When people eat with it a little bit with their peanut sauce, but when you eat the spring roll, you have to eat with the fish sauce, nuk mum. That's authentic, and the nuk mum is authentic because we cook it exactly like in Vietnam. We use real fish sauce, and all the ingredients in there are like in Vietnam. Yeah. So when we eat for Vietnamese people come in, sometimes American people think, oh, they they can tell the difference between you know nuk mum authentic or not, but for Vietnamese people coming, they eat that, they taste that with a noodle, and they say, just like Vietnam. For the last three years, I think people are starting to acknowledge about Vietnamese food more and more. I think it's healthy, it's decent, it's reasonable. Um, for us here, the portion is huge. So people come in and sometimes people share the food and things like that. Um, Pros and cons, you have people, I think a lot of like, uh, new people coming in to support New Orleans after Katrina. People come and go, but I think since you live in New Orleans, you will never leave. You will come back.